Barricky Beats, who's done it pretty well, actually, at the 550. Up towards the home corner, Barricky Beats, he's doing it well. A length and a half, all too much, who's trailing him. Two lengths confusing. Mitchell had a quick peep over the shoulder. He's just in two minds whether or not to let him really go. On the rails now, Cool Image starts to wind up. Mossman Flyer and now Falcon Crest. He calls upon Barricky Beats as all too much levels up to him. At the 200, they're together, confusing Cool Image and Falcon Crest running on and proxy along the rail on the outside all too much Barricky beats coming back Barricky beats all too much and now Falcon Crest Falcon Crest in the last stride delivered a KO Falcon Crest got to all too much Barricky beats and in behind them came confusing and proxy close up together followed by cool image Mossman fly the forgotten one and Burgio low flying second last and trailing them home Bevel Alana, another tremendous performance by this Galloper since joining your stable three from three now. Yeah, he's going along super. You said that you were going to be really patient with a step upper when with the Durant stable, they're obviously racing over 2,000 metres plus, but with the turn of foot that we've seen, you decided to start in the mile and it's worked a treat. Yeah, it's worked good, although I thought today took a lot longer to hit his straps and get there, so maybe now's a good time to go up. William was just, uh, you know, again, we've seen how good he is. So many jockeys probably would have thought they were out of a chance there, but again, he's just able to lift and the weight swings mean nothing when he's on board. Yeah, well, he just managed just to keep him balanced and keep him going forward. And, um, yeah, when he puts pressure on them late, they've got something to give. As we said, only the third run now for the stable. But from what you've seen at home, as you said, you're feeling it is maybe time just to start increasing slowly? I think so. Maybe on that run, I'll speak to Willie about it. But he's, he's definitely a progressive horse, so it would be good to see where he goes from here. Seems to be one that's just really enjoying his racing time. I and even now he's come in, he's still full of beans. And is he like that at home, always uh, wired and ready to go? Yeah, he's pretty quirky, but he's in a really good headspace at the moment. And he's, um, yeah, just nice and healthy and r happy and relaxed. So it's good. Certainly going very well for the stable now. The final race of the day, Chocoholic. Big test today. Yeah, very big test. Uh, I'm not confident. Um, today will tell me where he's at, I guess. What are you more concerned about, the strength of the field or the barrier? Well, he's been meeting four and six horse field, so this is there's some nice horses with good form in it. Um, Puna Moo's got very good form. Um, and, yeah, just yeah, it does worry me a little bit, but today will show me if he's any good. Let's hope that he can lift for it. Congratulations. Thank you. We'll grab William Pite now as well. and. William, we talked about it then, uh, that it, maybe it took a little bit longer than it has normally to uh, attack the line, uh, and that maybe a step up to due, but again, it was a tremendous performance. Yeah, it is. Um, you just got to take him a little bit on trust, because he doesn't travel into the race. But uh, when you get him into the clear in the straight, he gives his all, but you know, if you want it before straightening, you, you're left waiting. The turn of foot again, though, were explosive, and that's the reason why they've stayed at the mile this time. Yeah, he's got a good turn of foot, but I think that's a little bit attributed to because he gives you about 80% on the turn, so he's got plenty to give in the straight. You must have been happy. Uh, obviously, last week when the races were called off, you were drawn wide. Today, you were able to come into barrier five, so that was certainly an added bonus as well. Yeah, it's, um, I don't think he really cares too much where he is in the run, but I was happy they were off because it's a bit wet. Well done, mate. Congratulations. Thank you.